Alright, hello everybody, welcome back to KH Plays. Today we are playing more Ninja Gaiden 3 for the PlayStation 3. This is going to be Day 5. Let's do this. So today I'm playing with my new controller. Um, they came in this morning. And honestly, I expected these controllers to feel like absolute dog shit, but they actually feel really nice. Like, these controllers are actually, like, insane. I'm only using one of them right now. Um, but, like, I put this thing through the stress test this morning when I got it. I played through MK9 on Expert with it. Super responsive, right? Played some Ninja Gaiden Sigma. Super good feeling. No dead zones. Really good controllers. What the hell do you think you're doing? You trying to be a hero? We've made inquiries with your government, and they have denied any and all involvement in your activities. I'm acting under the orders and authorization of the Japanese Ministry of Defense, External Affairs. We tried to find this Ishigami, who you claim was running the op. No one knows where he is. But the group was calling for Hayabusa back in you London. You are not the UN. You don't get to go running around trying to solve the world's problems. Your actions are a direct affront to the sovereignty of other nations. That is a very serious offense. You will cease this operation immediately. Or what, dickhead? Ryu would just These like. These so called ninja are ghosts of a forgotten age. These are different times with different rules. You don't belong here. But what about the threat? Enough! Now, as long as we understand each other, you may go. We're rendezvousing with another vessel which will take you back to Japan. That is all. You're dismissed. I said, you are dismissed. Yes, sir, Captain Ass Wipe. But dude, even if like Ryu like found out about it, like which he most likely would have, he would have just saved the world in silence. Also, why doesn't he have his mask on? I can't get in touch with him. Cliff even tried to warn me. I hope Cliff is safe. Listen, you can't give up hope. You have to be strong for Kana. I know. The truth is, Kana isn't my real daughter. My sister married Cliff's brother, and, well, Kana's their child. Kana doesn't talk much. There was an accident. My sister and her husband were killed. It was such a shock to her, both parents just gone. So I took her in, and it's been over a year now. Kana! What's up? You getting hungry? Uh. <laughs> Kana, you mustn't ask people things like that. Oh, what am I gonna do with you? Oh, we're sorry. We're very, very sorry. No, no. I, I just never thought of being a father. I'm touched. Hey, you! Your ride's here! You see here, what Ryu would have normally done is just like sat there with his arms folded, Cliff. dead silent the whole time, I'm looking so over the water, okay. and then the ignoring them, attacked. glance down at Kana, see the text, oh, and be Kana. like, I'm touched, and then just continue to look I'm out. I know, I While I don't mind the humanization of Ryu, I feel That's sometimes they push about. it a bit too far. Anything about Ishigami? No. It was just like you said. But at the same time, it's nice to see a softer side of Ryu. It's just extremely different coming to it from, like, what was before. Whatever it is, doesn't make any sense. Something's up. Hayabusa, what about you? I must return to my village. I... I need to look into something. Then it's settled. I'll get a chopper to take us back to Japan ASAP. We get another one of those loading screens right here. 
Now, I don't mind the story in this game. I don't think it's great. I think it's okay. But, I don't know. Sometimes they take the humanization air quotes for Ryu. Um, they take it a bit too far sometimes. It's kind of weird to see Ryu acting out of character, but I don't mind it. It's not awful. Be careful, Hayabusa. I'll be back soon. Alright, here we go. This is my favorite day in the game. This is day five. Alright, so now it's time to test out how the, um, the joysticks feel in this game. They felt alright in Ninja Gaiden Sigma. Overall, uh, they're called P3. That's just the, um, the name of the controller is just P3. Pretty decent third party controllers. If I had to like review them, I'd actually give them actually a solid 9.5 out of 10. Okay, let's do this. Bone going. Ow. That fucking hurt. Alright, so our weapons are um, a little bit. Ow. So that there can be used as a launcher, but. I don't remember the input. I believe it's like you press towards them, and then press square, square, triangle. You can use it against the alchemists, which I have found another really good trick for taking care of the alchemists with the eclipse site that isn't just the, um, the rotate Y repeatedly. That's the uh, new is in the drop combo. It's just the underworld drop. Um, but I think it's actually, you know, pretty um, pretty awesome. And yes, we do have a new sword. As you saw, we um, we took Genshin's sword. Alright, so those are the um, types of ninja that can break your um, steel on bone. They're basically like the ninja equivalents for the um, the what you call it, the command, like the armored commandos and the beret commandos. Yeah, I love that as a drop. Alright, 
here um, you're gonna get some archers drop on your face so that I don't get grabbed. I got like nothing back for that. It's cause I only grabbed like one person. There. Get a little bit more health back. Here we get this pretty, um, this pretty, um, sick, um, climbing segment. I actually don't mind a lot of the, um, the segments like this in the game. A lot of people have issues with it, but I don't mind the kunai climb segments and stuff like that. I don't think that they're awful. So you are under a tiny bit of time pressure here. Because if you stay up there for too long, the bridge will collapse. <laughs> Excuse me. Alright, 
So we don't get the safe Falcon just yet. Am I now? I've been waiting for you. Well fun, well die. Well fun, well die. Brothers, get out of here! So they're well well die. Sorry if I'm going quiet. It's just these enemies are actually pretty um difficult. Well fought, well die. Excuse me, dude. The hit detection in this game is kind of janky sometimes. Your pride is your hey, look at that. It's the save statue from Ninja Gaiden 1 and 2. Another on landing 360. There we go. I love fighting the um the ninja enemies, but sometimes just their hit detection is very much whack. Pause it for a second so I get something to drink right here. But yeah, honestly, I I really dig this new controller. It's a very good feeling. Feels like a dream. So, this um, entire level is just a, basically a big ass barrage. Razor's Edge, there's another save point right before here. Alright. It's pretty difficult to get the, um, the uh, spin happening in a consistent chain in this game with the, um, the uh, Eclipse site. It's pretty difficult to um, get that ball rolling. Oh, 
This is the um the first stage that gets actually more serious and you actually kind of have to pay attention. Very much so have to um pay attention and you know get that ball rolling. Bro, why are you, like, over there? Well, Go ahead and crunch down on him. And trust me, this is, like, one of those fights that just kind of never ends. So the camera is going a tad haywire. So, yep, this is another Grip of Murder sequence. Honestly, in terms of like moving around here, I actually just like if you press the square button, Ryu will move faster. There's another one right here. Let's get rid of him. And now we can go that way. So this is another um pretty long chapter. I looked away for a second so I can grab something to drink. But yeah, so far this new controller feels pretty sick. I'm not even gonna lie, I really like this new controller. Yeah, so here as you can see the uh, curse is getting the better of Ryu. Is Ryu gonna die? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. I really like the group of murder cutscenes in this game. Not the sequences, but the cutscenes. Master Ryu, you must not move. Master Ryu! <laughs> Please get better soon, so you can start training us again. I feel much better already, Sanji. <laughs> Sanji is the one who found you, Master Yu. So, you saved me. <laughs> Don't let it go to your head. Sanji! I'll train with you anytime you want. Oh. 
Master Joe is waiting in the Hermitage outside the village. We should go together. I think here would have been an awesome like time to introduce like more costumes in the game. Like imagine if right here like Ryu went back to wearing like his traditional ninja guards. That's good, you. Are you okay? Sorry for scaring you. I'm fine. Thank the gods. You can thank Sanji for that. So this is a pretty cool section. You just get the now, stroll the through the um village. We'll meet soon. Master Liu, I'm so happy you're okay. I worked on your bow. Here. Thanks. So here we get to test out the new bow. Basically, it's just like it's a. nothing. That's a very strange bow, though. Here, I see here. Watch closely. Looks like you did a good job. Wow. Hmm. Master Yu, may you have victory in battle. Sir, overcoming I heard he was lying on the ground near death just a few pride. minutes ago. Amazing. <laughs> Uh, here it gives me like early Naruto vibes. Just like going through. You see like all the kids running around. Are you going to see your father? Yeah. It seems the Black Spider clan is planning something again. You can leave the village to me. Me and the young ones. They can use the training. Thanks, Kenjiro. Practicing. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever beat you. I'm looking forward to our training. Unfortunately, they got rid of Sanji's old voice actor. That's probably like the one voice actor I have the complaint with the Sanji's new voice actor. Just a generic, um, like anime. Japanese kid voice. They like, didn't do badly, it's just it sounds off. I mean, Troy Baker's Ryu isn't terrible. He did great as Snow in Final Fantasy, and I feel he did really good as James Sunderland in um, the HD version of Silent Hill 2. Master Ryu. Thanks for waiting. Let's go. Okay. Momiji, my favorite female character from the Ninja Gaiden series. So here we go, back in the gameplay. I'm gonna switch back to the dragon sword real quick. I've been waiting. Time for I've been waiting. Just the Lord Now, Momiji's a pretty good companion in this uh, level, I find. 
some wonky ass protection that much. Well fought, I can well die. Master Ryu, you're amazing. As are you, Momiji. I've been waiting. I've been waiting. There we go. I've been waiting. How do you know it's okay? Well, fought. Well done. Go ahead and do a drop right there. Oh, I've been fucking waiting for Dead. Well fought, well done. Oh. So, this is death. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Just get some of uh, some fucking flying swallows and obliterations on their way. You see. I'm just glad I could help. We must hurry. Boom. So I just want to get rid of these guys. So this this chapter is pretty fun, you know. It's the uh, first chapter in the game where, like I said before, the difficulty actually kind of starts to starts to pick up, at least on normal mode. All right, so here we go, big ass arena fight. Wow. Yep. Look at that whack ass hit detection. Listen here, fucker. Is this soul summoning? Ow. Oh, yeah. You can be steel and boned. Dude, did he just dodge and grab me? That he did. Hold on, I'm gonna just go straight to the um the Falcon Talons. Dude, why am I, like, missing the fucking obliteration techniques?
That's the on landing spiral with the um so yeah, just do the flying swallow with the um talons here. Drop on your face. This right here, you want to equip your um, clip sight. The 360 uh, motion with the. Um... But yeah, that's basically the other way you um, take care of the alchemists. Other than just doing that or the on landing motion. Be the uh, first level where I die due to combat. Yo, dude, listen. cinematic cutscenes where Ryu has no control. Bit more 
bearable. I usually tend to stay on this side of the, um, the fucking cyst thing that we have to attack. with the, um... with the scythe right there and it works really well. Alright, and that is the end of day five. I hope you all enjoyed. This was my favorite chapter in the whole game. Anyways, I love you all, and I'll see you in the next video. I'm out. Peace.